Hi, I'm back for part two. I'm going to finish up my makeup. All right. So I did my foundation. I did um, my powder. I set my face. I tried out the CYO Life Proof Foundation, which I'm liking. My face feels a little tacky. I'm not sure if it's the, um, the Tatcha spray I used, but... I don't know. It looks nice though. So I'm going to use the Too Faced uh, Milk Soleil Bronzer in Light Medium. This is like a little deluxe sample. I hit pan on it. And I'm going to use the Jaclyn Hill um, H H or JH02 I believe. It's like a bronzer brush. Dip it in there. Yeah, my other video, um, I said I was going. I'm going to see Wizard of Oz at my daughter's school, like a musical. One of her friends is a Munchkin, so I think it'll be fun to go watch and support. I'm just doing a simple, simple makeup look. I don't want to look all done up for it, but let's see. Where is my blush brush? Oh, here it is. Sorry. I'm definitely not a professional. <laughs> I have the Morphe and Jaclyn Hill JH04. It's the blush. I love it. It's my favorite. I love how it's slanted. I'm going to use the Note Desert Rose. It's like a like an orangey peachy color. I just make sure I take some of it off. And just pat a little bit. Add some life to my face. And then for highlight, I'm going to use the Physician Formula Vegas Strip. I love this one. This one has been around for a while. Um, when I search it up on YouTube, I get like a lot of older videos. But I think it's beautiful. And then I have my Morphe and Jaclyn Hill JH09 brush. Just a little tapered highlighting brush. Just put it in my high points. I don't want to be blinding. Just like a little. Put some under my brow. Inner corner. My lip. A little on my nose. Okay, my face is done, and then I'm going to work on my eyeshadow. I have the Too Faced um, Semi Sweet. I got some foundation on it. Jeez, I'm a mess. <laughs> I don't know, it's just like a neutral palette. I'm not sure if this has been discontinued. I found this at Marshalls for like $24. The original price is like $50. I'm not doing nothing crazy, just very simple. Here, I'm gonna use this. This is from Arlemar Cosmetics. Um, the maker of this is Gabby. She's Kathleen Light's friend. I'm just gonna take the shade Coconut Cream and put it all over my lid. Just for a base, make sure everything's set. And then I'm going to take, I don't know, this shade right here for my crease. And just blend it up in my crease just for a little definition. I'm definitely doing, like I said, 
a million times. Very simple. And I don't want to take too long. Because we have to leave in a half hour. And then I have the shade uh, Peanut Butter. I'm going to use the same brush. Just put it in my crease. I'm just building up. other side okay I'm a little under okay and then I'm going to take this is like my quick everyday makeup look let's see I'm going to take my dirty <laughs> wet n wild eyeshadow brush and I'm going to take a dark shade we'll do put in put in in my outer corner just to deepen it up a little I just like the look of doing that I think this eyeshadow palette it's not super pigmented, but I think it's beginner friendly, definitely, because it's not like crazy. It's not like a Anastasia palette where it's full of pigment. Just make sure everything's blended. And then I'm going to take the uh, Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH43. Just like a flat definer brush, I'm going to take the shade Licorice, the black, and I might move up for this. Make sure my eye is clean. <laughs> and I'm going to run this along my lash line. Just lightly. I just want a little definition. See, I think it I think it definitely makes a difference. Okay. And then I'm gonna find like a pencil brush. Something to blend it in. Oh, here's my brush strip. <laughs> that drives my friend Sarah nuts. It drives everyone nuts. Okay, and then I have this Luxie mini round 141 it came in a set of three in the boxy charm i believe they saw this on nordstrom rack i'm not sure okay then i'm gonna take like a light uh, brown and just blend it all in on both sides just so there's no harsh lines Then I'm going to add like a shimmer. I always add a shimmer. Time. We're already at eight minutes. <laughs> I'm just going to use my finger. <laughs> and let's see. Good shade. You know what? I think I'm going to use my highlighter. If I can find it. Everything just disappears. You know what? I'm going to use a single. I'm going to use this old thing from CoverGirl. I don't even know what shade. I think it's like ice champagne or something. I'm just going to take my finger and dot it. Like pat it on my eye. Like a swipe. Just to brighten it up. Just a nice, simple look. Okay, and then I'm gonna go back with my definer with the licorice, it's like a black. 
and just run it along my lash line for more definition. I haven't been using liquid liner lately. Sometimes I do, but I like the look of using eyeshadow as liner. I think it looks natural. I have the LA Girl Fiber Lash Mascara. Not a very good. I wouldn't recommend it. It's just, I bought it, so I'm going to use it up. So. Um, sometimes I curl my lashes. Um, sometimes I don't. Since I'm doing really natural look today, very simple. I'm not even going to bother. I actually think this mascara is on its way out. It's almost gone. I'm not getting much um, payoff. I love going through my product. I, like, I love it when I finish up a product and I got my money's worth out of it. Definitely not getting much color payoff. Try again. Another coat. There we go. It's building up. So what is everybody else doing today? On this Sunday afternoon. Anybody making corned beef and cabbage for St. Patrick's Day? I have mine in the crock pot right now. I work next weekend, so I won't have time. I work every other weekend. This is the brow gal. Um, instant brown hair uh, 08. It's a tinted brow gel with microfibers. I received this in a boxy charm. I don't do much with my brows. Honestly, I, I need to get them waxed. Um, but I don't do that very often. <laughs> I am just a mom, everyday mom works and loves makeup as my hobby <laughs> that's all <laughs> all right I just want to put a little highlight I don't know what I did with my highlighter I just used and showed you <laughs> I'll just use this one since I can't find the one I just used. Um, Triple Baked Highlighter by Makeup Revolution, Goddess of Faith. This one is really nice. I'm going to take, find a brush and my little bag of brushes I have in front of me. I have this one. This is a really nice one. Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH40. It's like a small blending brush. I'm going to use this and just put it under my brow bone. And then some in my inner corner. I love the look of a highlight in the inner corner. Alright, and then we're going to pop, just pop on some lip gloss. This is Wet n Wild, a limited edition lip gloss in Ring My Bell Bottoms. This was a, like a Christmas collection. I just opened it recently, so it doesn't smell bad or anything. Just 
just a shiny lip gloss. Probably fix my hair and get ready to go. So I hope you guys have a wonderful Sunday. And if anybody watches this, I appreciate it. Thank you for watching. And just starting off, I just like to do this as a hobby. And I don't know. I think it's fun. So, bye. See you later.